Hi guys, welcome to this short video about drop test of the Ducci, Ducci S96 Pro. You can see that here, Ducci Rugged Phone S96 Pro here. And it's a really nice, uh, solid phone, of course, a really rugged phone, waterproof, drop resistant. But how drop resistant is it really? So I'm going to drop the thing from 200 meters. No, I'm not going to do that. It's, uh, I, I love it too much. I don't want to destroy this thing. But I'm going to tell you what has happened to this phone just yesterday. Yeah, what we have here with this phone uh, is a little bit a uh, disadvantage when we want to grab it here from the side. I mean, it's usually what we do. Of course, at the beginning I was using a hand strap a little bit the first days or weeks. Now I got a little bit lazy and I always grab it like this. And the thing is because it's a rugged phone, there are no cases available which would provide some extra grip or extra protection. But yeah, it's a rugged phone. It's intended to be a little bit rugged a little bit large so you usually have still a nice grip the problem is that it's pretty slippery on both sides it's uh, either metal yeah I think it's metal actually probably aluminum or something like that I think it's it's not plastic it's pretty uh, hard here but anyway it's a little bit slippery and what happened yesterday I grabbed it and I lost it and what you do when you lose something, you want to grab it and I did it with full force and I really smashed it into the ground. So it was dropping on the floor much faster than it would normal from three feet. It was uh, dropping into or almost smashing into the ground like uh, from about six feet at least i would say it was crazy in a sudden some family members showed up and i mean it was dropping onto a tile floor really tough hard tile floor and it took just a couple of seconds and then some family me members showed up and asked me oh what has happened there was a huge bump uh, noticeable even in other rooms so you can imagine how hard this drop really was i mean this phone here is a, a solid really heavy thing it has about the double the weight of a normal phone so it this thing is really massive if you drop this thing from two meters you can feel it uh, in the whole home i can tell you the really positive thing till now i mean it's 24 hours since then and i couldn't notice anything so everything works you can see a fingerprint sensor camera i've been doing phone calls i've been doing almost everything and it looks like it survived uh, the drop with absolutely no damage also on the screen there is nothing visible here even if you look at the corners i have really no clue where it dropped but it looks like same way as it always looked before the really good thing is here that the glass is a little bit recessed you can see it's not much but just a little bit maybe half a millimeter or something like that not much but i really love that the glass is not really on top when i hear usually other people's phone dropping you hear like glass or plastic or metal or something like that and this thing hit the floor it was more like something really heavy in full rubber hit the floor i think it even jumped up so there was absolutely nothing uh, which concerned me which i heard with a lot of other phone drops uh, yeah it sounds very scary it sounds concerning you know it's almost certain that something broke here there was absolutely nothing to hear no cracking no nothing really just solid full rubber thing hitting the ground and uh, so it looks like it doesn't have any damage also what i love here is with this camera even with some other rugged phones the camera has still a bump you can see that here it's still a little bit recessed and i can tell you that helps a lot over time i'm pretty sure this will help a lot to keep this thing safe so overall i love the thing and maybe i'm going to use the hand strap a little bit more in the future but if you are considering to buy something like that or especially the ducci s96 pro then i can give you a full recommendation at least regarding the drop safety 
and I've already made a full review uh, regarding function speed and everything and most of it is really convincing it has even wireless charge it has NFC and everything just the camera I mean the camera isn't really nice it has some kind of night infrared camera but it doesn't have a video function for the infrared uh, night thing and the camera quality yeah is really really just like uh, mediocre it's not a premium camera but i would say at this price range for what we get is this huge battery and everything working really good solid fast a lot of storage i can give you full recommendation even after the drop test and uh, i'll put down the link to the amazon listing down into the description so you can check it out and drive from there if you like it and i hope i've been able to help you a little bit with this video Video. If you have any questions or comments, just write to the comment section below. I'm always happy to talk about the things. And if you like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe my channel, thank you for watching, and see you next time.